there is just only mafuta. What do you call mafuta? Mafuta, oil. Eh? Mafuta. Eh? Fat. Fat. Oh, fat. Fat oil. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> so I was told that there is no that fat. And uh, my wife got four children. One year, one year. And the devil has had said that she can't have a baby unless she sleep or bed sleep. Bed? Bed sleep? Shut up. Understand my English. I was in school 1965. What do you want me to keep wearing in English? Some of the things you have, we, we didn't have them there. There is a teacher where my children are going to school. Some teachers who have mentor. Teachers and you have mentor. Don't try to bring nonsense. My child, I don't know what my child did. Then I went there. I was called. Now another again, I don't know what the child did. My wife went to their school. Then this stupid teacher said that unless his father come, I said, I will not come. Mind your own business. I'm paying you money to teach the child. Don't bring nonsense. On that day, I can go to school to listen nonsense. I am paying you to Educate them. They are stupid. Don't call me. If you want to call... Sasa mimi ni edhe nekaya hapo kwa mwalimu ni aniabie nini? Ibu wei imagine. Hello. Mwalimu wenyewe atafikiria nini sasa. Andres ye ni stupid. Mimi ni kaya hapo nganga mwalimu ni edhe mabu ya watoto. Mimi wenyewe naona ukiwa mutoto. Naona ukiwa na pepo. Nikaabia mama mimi siwezi kwenda. Mimi sasa hata mwalimu wewe ni mjinga. Mimi ni hakuna kitu taniambia hii mtoto mimi nijue. Sijui wanapewa wanapewa homework. Sasa niambie mimi nita akipewa homework nipeleke wapi? Nipeleke wapi? Watu wadogine ngombe mno sija. Ile nere alikuwabia jana ni gani? Ile walifanya jana sijui ya. Ile humu waka waliwabia si. Ingine. A science project. Eh? Science project. Sasa let me say. Science project. Warimu sa ingine mbukunyo chai. Iyo. Iyo perekea mama yako. Sasa sijui mama alienda waliabia na nini. Mimi sina ujinga ya kwenda kukaa kwa kwa shule. Mimi mwenyewe nilitadikwa na walimu. Wakikosea wewe tadika hawa. I want to bring to you this lady my viewers wherever you are because we are living by testimony. And the Bible says that you will win because of your testimony. They win. They win the battle because of their testimony. We become strong when we read a woman who was breeding for 12 years. We become strong when we read that Jesus forgive the prostitute. We become strong when we read at the close Jesus said, Father, forgive them they don't know. Through that testimony, we can forgive one another. At the old Bible, there was no forgiveness. That's why Jesus came. There was no peace. There was no forgiveness. And Jesus brought us peace, love, and unity, and forgive. As my father sent me, I now send you. If you don't forgive, there will be no forgiven. She used to have a spiritual husband for 11 years. 
You say it sometimes mlango inafunguliwa unaota. Yeah. Nasikia mtu anafungua mlango. Somebody is opening the door. Yeah. Then he comes to my bed. Mhm. Then after then pap. What is pap? Oh. Do you know pap in South Africa? The door is opened. Then all of a sudden she hear pap. spiritual husband pap the work is done pap is the work is eh hey. <laughs> for 11 years yeah do you have this picture i want to see do you have this you can look there and tell me for 11 years imekuwa na infection for 11 years na ikishida ya kusumbuliwa na spiritual husband umeolewa hana are you married no oh you are 11 years kutoka nikiwa class 6 hata kwa nyumba akulaliki akulaliki mm, what what ana sumbuliwa na pia maro ya watu walikufa tunawaona tu all throughout una watoto sina mtoto she don't have a child not married una mtoto ndio 11 years uko na spiritual husband 11 years you have a spiritual husband and if he said analipa nyumba spiritual husband a spiritual husband paid the house no she's going to come apige hodi hana akuulizi ni kuingia tu na kutoka ngalia tu data kingia wanasikia jo mwili wangu na kuanga week na kwa wait unakuwa na infection inaendelea kuongezeka tu unakuwa wet mm. is something like lean eh? yeah oh. you are 22 years unafanya kazi mimi sina kazi hata ndugu zangu anahangaika tu she's work unafanya nini she don't have work the whole family is in problem education she lost education kakosa pesa no money college kapotea equity ni kitu imezaliwa kitu sasa naishi kitu nyumbani ama town naishi kitu nyumbani na mzazi wangu kweli eh kwetu kwa mamangu oh no we 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 who are you 